Guten Tag and welcome back everybody to Sky Factory 2.5 with yours truly, Buster. I hope you had a great weekend. Mine was awesome. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh, today we want to look more into Applied Energistics ME system, as you can see right behind me. Um, obviously, I didn't finish all the production chains for all those um, but I um, I did a little bit for example uh, you can see here I added the 4k 1k and 16k storage component and uh, for the for the 64k storage component we need all those um, and I wanted to craft this but um, when you look at the top left corner, when I look over there, I am down to 20 frames per second. <laughs> Instead of over there, where I'm reaching, uh, well, 70 something, 60, 70. Reason being, um, I infested every single tree over there <laughs> with a silkworm. Um, because we need string. And to harvest all this, oh, let me head over there. So legs might get way worse, uh, but we have to live with it. Let me place it here. So we have a few um, compressed crooks here. Uh, so we can actually harvest this um, total crazy amount of leaves. Okay, so. Uh, this might as well crash my game. <laughs> so if it does, we will see us in a second. Let's hope for the best. Whoop. Okay. At least it didn't crash. And... Oh, there are still... There are still leaves uninfested. Not infested. What is the word for it? Um, okay. Oh, and even not all trees grown. I haven't suspected that. Do we have crooks left? We do. Let's see. Okay, this goes way better than I thought it would. Uh, let's see here. Oh, this might be um, actually... Why is it not working now? Hello? You are too hungry. Oh. <laughs> um. <laughs> um, good. Whoop. It eats up a lot of hunger. Oh, a lot of hunger. I'm already hungry again. Um, let's see. Do I have food left? <laughs> I have apple juice left. <laughs> well, it works. It works. Um, the reason for this being uh, we need wool. Oh, I'm, I have full inventory already. Uh, we need wool. This is the reason being for what I am doing here. Uh, because to make all the better cables... Oh, we are, oh no, look, we are not out of crooks. Um, let's see. I made too many of those, <laughs> for sure. Okay, um, let, me, let me put this into here. Uh, reason being is um, better ME cables. We need the... Um, the uh, smart cables and dense cables and stuff like that to have more channels available to our disposal and um, to have that and again no crooks and to have that uh, we need um, wool to make covered cables and from covered cables uh, we will go on and make uh, the other tiers of cables so to have that we need wool um, the obvious choice for getting wool is of course sheep i don't need this anymore no oh, let's see um the obvious uh, source is sheep of course but i don't want to abuse any sheep here uh, therefore i decided to go with something else and i will go the route of um of magical crops 
and we will grow our wool on a field and harvest it. <laughs> uh, I thought this would be a way to get more familiar with um, with primordial, no, 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 not primordial crops, that is a 1.10 mod um, with uh, magic crops. And then we can, oh, let's see, I have to store it somewhere. Um, and then we can go from there with wool. So we have a lot of string now. Um, the rest of the of the trees I will harvest um, just with the harvester, um, the system that is installed over there. So we have more than enough string, I suppose. Um, but what we really wanted to do is um, make the 64K storage unit. Therefore, let's see, 64K, uh, this one here, we need one of those. For one of those, we need three of these. So to make the recipe for one of these, we need actually three of those. Uh, so I will craft them right now. Let's see, these are the 16K, we need three. And you can see already um, how many crafting steps. Oh, I'm missing crystals. Oh, that's odd. Well, let's see. Uh, I have somewhere over the rainbow. <laughs> let's see here. Um, search squads block. This is the stuff. Uh, we can make them back into crystals. But I have to come up with the source of those as well. Uh, well, we can always mine for them, of course. Let's see here. And what was the other thing that's missing? 16k, 3. Is something still missing? Yes. The quartz glass is missing. Nine of those. Um, quartz. Uh, let me let me um, quickly gather the materials needed and then we will craft the thing. Um, I think I've got another problem now. <laughs> you can see what's over there. All the mobs. Oh, by the way, by the way, guys, um, I uh, read a comment from... I totally forgot the name. Um, the reason why we hadn't any mob spawn here was the um, the the giant torch that was standing here in front of the smeltery. It is gone by now, so we will have uh, mob spawns back in the area. And I didn't know that. Okay, but that wasn't what I wanted to show you. Um, I need more quartz glass. And this is just uh, quartz and glass. But you can see here, uh, I connected the glass um, cache. Device missing channel is the error message we get. And when we look down here, not upwards, downwards, thank you very much, um, we have eight of eight channels. So to connect the glass cache and all the other caches up there, we need additional um, data channels. Therefore, we need the better cables. Hence the fact why we did that thing with the strings over there. Uh, okay, I will continue to prepare myself and be back in a second. And we are good to go for the 16K storage module. We have all materials we need or we can craft them. So let's start it. And we can see here what is doing. And we can see here what it's currently crafting. And guys, honestly, I like this so much. How this is, um, how this is shown, how this is done. Really, really neatly done. And he crafted another one of those. Why did he do that? Just use it. He crafts one every time? Well, that doesn't make any sense. Oh, I think because, because it is comparing NBT and metadata and because it is damaged, it will craft another one. Oh, but it is already finished. <clears throat> nice, so we have three of those. But the um, ultimate goal, of course, was the, not the 6K, the 64K storage, this one. And therefore we need this one. And we have to make all those yet, so we can easily craft one. I will make a recipe for, oh no, I can make it right away. Otherwise I have to craft it again. Um, by the way, if you know how it is possible to make um, a crafting recipe, a pattern like this, without the need of having the materials present. Hello? Is it still in the crafting window? 
It is. <clears throat> the system is awesome if you use it correctly. <laughs> if not, it's not. Let's see. 64K. This thing here. Craft it. Make a pattern for it. Thank you very much. Place the pattern in the interface. And craft it. Pa -da -da. There we go, 64K. Um, what else do we need for the actual thingy here? Just a little bit of iron. Um, I removed the iron thingy here. So let's use the iron here. Okay, 64K. And there we go. Uh, will I make a pattern for this? Oh, why not? <clears throat> why not? Um, that way we can craft it right away. 64K, pattern, thank you very much. And the finished product. <laughs> I thought I could grab it another time. I can't. Um, okay, now install it real quick. Oh man, the episode is almost over and I've done nothing. Um, let's see, here's the disk drive, 64K. Good. So what I recognized it, we can just um, store 63 different types of items in there. Um, so we can store 64,000 items or 60, 65,536, but only of 63 different types. Well, zero means 64 different types. Um, so we have to make a few more of those, obviously because we have way more than 63 items. And we can even store Essentia from the um, from the Thorncraft base and stuff like that. So, uh, next thing with, these, with this system uh, we want to do is uh, make more, uh, make all the import storage thingies here, these things, what is it? Storage bus. So we can connect actually all the um, caches and then we need uh, import buses to import all the materials from the modular storage system, like like this here, <clears throat> and I made one already. Um, it is somewhere. Let me let me quickly here. Me storage. Uh, Me import bus. So we can then just easily connect the import bus boop like this. But right now, it has no channel, so we can't do it. But we can remove this, and now this should have a channel. It doesn't, for whatever reason. Device missing channel. Oh, okay. Um, but we will um, we will solve that problem with more cables or better cables. And we have one with um, sixty with thirty two channels. Um, let me quickly uh, try to to make a few of those. We have a string already, so we can make wool, and then uh, maybe we can hook this thing up. All right, so we are crafting cables, you can see here, <laughs> totally automatically. We don't have to do nothing. Nice. Um, I thought I might as well go ahead <clears throat> and place the, um, the sheep seeds. So you can see here, we are gathering sheep essence and make wool from it. And, and I already made over a stack just from the tiny bit here. Um, so this is working quite nice and it is really easy and we could implement it and uh, it in a existing system. Nice. So all we need to do now is mm, get rid of these cables here and replace it with dense cables. I suppose. All right. So now it is showing nine of 32. Yeah, <clears throat> great. So it is it is actually working. Let's see, gather all the cables we scattered across. Um, and now reconnect storage bus. Yeah, <clears throat> there's the timer. Uh, reconnect the storage bus, for example, here for the glass. Um, I have no regular cables left. Hmm. Ah, it doesn't matter. Just, oops, that is not the way. Um, just place it 
here. No? Hello, thank you. Good, just place it there and grab um, regular cables. <clears throat> Excuse me, I have a bad throat. And do that and it is online and you should hopefully see, yeah, items in here are diminishing. Uh, I need to upgrade the importer so it will happen uh, way faster. And of course we need more 64K storage um, units, but now we have the possibility to do so. Yeah, you can see already 16 or 32 channels. So to connect all the caches up top, uh, we need even more than one cable. Um, I think the same guy that, I, I need to look up the name, give me a second. It was the big money 001. Big shout outs to you, mate. Thank you very much for the awesome tips. Um, he said that you can even um, make more of those, I think in a seven by seven cube or something he said, so we can um, easily connect more of those cables. So the possibilities we have are um, way better than I anticipated. But uh, this will do it for today. The episode already exceeded the usual 15 minutes and we will see us again in the next time. Take care of yourself, guys, and rock on.